Just let me, please let me preach. You can either step out or I'm going to drag you out. That's your option. Terrell Johnson's ordeal began April 13, 2016, after an arrest by St. Paul Police. Johnson was pepper sprayed and taken to the Ramsey County Jail. The 13-minute interaction between Johnson and sheriff's deputies was caught on camera. Sit back then. <laughs> With his hands cuffed behind his back and a spit guard mask on his face, Johnson is pushed by one deputy and pulled by another as they try to strap him into a transport chair. Oh, sit down. Oh, sit down. Deputy Travis Vanderwilly can be seen kneeing Johnson in his stomach. You ain't seen excessive force before. The video shows 24-year-old Terrell Johnson begging for his life. You can also hear him crying out in pain as deputies push his head into his lap. Members of the African American Leadership Council and the St. Paul NAACP stood in solidarity with current Ramsey County Sheriff and Undersheriff to denounce the treatment of Johnson by deputies. What happened to Terrell Johnson is a tragedy. No human being should be treated in that manner. Mayor Melvin Carter says deputies showed failures in abuse of force, training, culture, and accountability. Seeing those punches, seeing those kicks, seeing that treatment, uh, the torture. I mean, if, if, if we saw a video of that arise from any other country or someplace else in the world, we would call it torture. Vanderwilly was charged by the Minneapolis City Attorney's Office with two counts of fifth degree assault, a misdemeanor. As part of a plea agreement, Vanderwilly pled guilty to disorderly conduct and paid a $150 fine.